Welcome to the demonstration of iNotify iPhone Incident Locator. The purpose of this application is to allow citizens to report roadway related incidents by street, highway or GPS location. This application is designed to showcase some of the core capabilities of the ArcGIS platform and ArcGIS iPhone SDK through a simple modern web 2.0 style user interface. This application allows users to report roadway incidents using point locations. These issues are stored in the Geo database using the new feature server editing capabilities at ArcGIS 10. You can launch the application by tapping the icon in App Gallery on your iPhone. You can report an incident by using your current GPS location or by entering an address. When launched for the first time, the application may prompt you to allow access to your current location using GPS. Tap OK if you would like to use your GPS location to report an incident. You may also report an incident by entering an address or tapping directly on the map. To use your GPS location, tap on this button. Let's enter an address to report an incident. So enter your address here in the search bar and tap on search. This displays a list of results that closely match the address you just entered. Tap the address you want to use. And choose the type of incident you wish to report by scrolling this list and tapping on select type. This will take you back to the map view where we can see all the address results as red diamond shaped markers and the map tip is open for the result you just chose. At any point you can go back to the list of results and choose a different result. Tap the details button on the map tip to start reporting the incident. You can enter the description here and optionally provide your email address and Twitter ID to receive updates about this incident. You can also attach a photograph to this incident by tapping photo. You can choose to take a new photo or use an existing photo. Let's choose existing photo. Tap done to complete reporting the incident. Tap OK to confirm the submission and that's it. The incident is now available for other users of this application. To see the incident you just reported, tap on the incident and tap next on the map tip and you can see its details and photo attachment for this incident. By using this button, you may also add an incident directly by tapping on the map and selecting the type and it changes to reflect. You can enter the description. and attach a photograph and tap on done and the incident is created. Let's have a look at the application settings. So we see an entry for iNotify, 
and we see an entry for URL which points to an XML file available on a public server. The application picks up the configuration settings from this XML file which can be easily modified to suit your needs. For example, you may change the URLs for street map, aerial map, locator service, locator fields, the pin layer which is the feature service used to store incidents and a couple of other settings like sorting the incident types in the selection list or using the GPS location on start. This application is designed as a configurable template so you can easily plug in your own feature service with different types of incidents and use it to create your own VGI application.